How's it going? So, like, when I play one-on-one -on -one against players, I was trying to understand why League of Legends players are not so good, right? Like, there is no challenge to play against one-on-one -on -one players because they literally are so bad. It's it's actually very, very boring. That's why I'm kind of sit here and play. Uh, five on five, right? And the answer to that is very simple. It's because counter-picking is a big problem. Because you see, like, I pick Nasus, they pick Mordekaiser. It takes no brains to play Mordekaiser into Nasus. It, like, it's, like, it's so brain-dead, it's so easy, it's, like, skillless. And can you imagine a person who goes through live counter-picking all the time? And then when he goes into blind pick and he picks a champion who is against another champion where it requires skill to play, he doesn't know what to do because he's so used to playing the um, strong side, counter-picking. Do you know what I mean? And that's what I feel like is actually happening to League of Legends players. Because when I when I play one on one against them, all the way even to master level, they're just so bad. It just feels like they're just beginners at the game. And the answer to that is because majority of the game they play, uh, they counter pick, right? So it, it, like think about it. Like it, let's say you pick a Lawi into Nasus. I mean, yes. or like Darius into Yasuo. There is really not much you can do as Yasuo against Darius, right? So he gets to kind of um, and and of course the coin flip as well because if you if you pick if you counter pick, like this guy here, right? It's whoever gets the best team wins. Even though like he killed me twice, he couldn't carry because he doesn't know how to carry with the champion. He just knows how to screw you over in the lane, <laughs> right? Because. One thing is winning the lane. The second thing is you have to understand that how champion to play him on macro level. Like, what does he have to do past the laning phase, right? And that's the problem with this guy is because he's he brainlessly picked the champion to counter pick and then he doesn't know what to do, right? So that was kind of a because oh, counter counterpicking is a big problem. It, it removes skill from the game. Would you agree? Think about it, right? If you if, if this is a card game and all they're doing is just picking a better card that counters the other card, they will have no skill. And it doesn't matter what level they are. But they, fundamentally, what happens is they're simply counterpicking and... Like, for example, I'll give you an example, right? Some people pick Timo into Trindamir when I play one-on-one. -on -one, and I can instantly detect that they don't know what they're doing. Like, I'll give you a good example. They use blind just uh, to harass you. That is a big mistake. Right? Then the next game they lose, they pick Jax. Right? And I know how to play against Jax. They lose... Oh, they pick Tom Kench. I know how to play against Tom Kench as well, right? Now the problem, problem. Even though I win in one on one, the problem of playing shit like Timo, Jax, Tom Kench into Trindamir is as a Trindamir player, I cannot get fed off this matchup, right? Although, of course, I can kill him like once or twice, but that's not enough to carry uh, the game. Right. So essentially what they're doing is they're just um they're removing themselves and removing you from the game when they counter pick, right? Because they don't have the skill on a champion to carry, right? Because there's a lot than winning the lane in League of Legends. There is like team fighting, there is macro, right? So if they counter pick a ch if they counter pick you, they don't know the nuances of the champion. All they know is how to make your life miserable, right? And because you are now playing weak side, you cannot impact the game either. So he cannot impact the game because he picked a champion that he doesn't know how to play, and you cannot pick and you cannot impact the game because in laning phase your life is so difficult. It's very difficult to do anything because the champion that he picked 
is so strong against you. Does that make sense? So effectively what happens is uh, the lane gets cancelled. And then it's pretty much a coin flip. If they have a better team, they win. If I have a better team, I win. In this matchup, this is exactly what happened. We kind of broke even with Mordekaiser, right? Because I'm Nasus, I was able to kind of uh, farm really well. I had 600 stacks. So I was effective, right? I was effective in the game. And he got like two kills, you know, he was okay, right? He got a couple of kills here and there. But the problem was he doesn't understand the champion. And on macro level, he just lost. And of course, I had the better team, right? So that's what I'm saying is they need to do something about it. Otherwise, the game is just pure coin flip. And they have to they have to remove counter picking. Because it's like it's such a it's 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 very like it's unskilled. Do you know what I mean? Like counter picking is just so unskilled. I don't even know what to say about it, you know? Alright, take care.